Hi everyone! Today's video is going to be about how to design a modern curtain for a bedroom in a simple way. But before I start explanation, my channel is about 3D designs and tutorials. So please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. So this is how it look like on 3D and I'm going to design in a simple way. So let's go to the ground floor. And then the first step we're going to do is going to the dimension. We're going to measure the distance between we have it on the window which is going to be 2200 so the second step I go to the document and then select uh, a line tool and then here pull the line and then we're gonna go over here around like 2600 I will make it more bigger so over here I will go with 40 and then I'm gonna close this line and then i will draw it at the center i'm gonna click with the first one and then i will draw at the center so the first step was measuring the place we're gonna design the second was drawing a line or to say we're gonna go to the design and then select the shell tool and we have here three types which is the metric method we're gonna go with the first one which is extruded and then here we have the construction method we're gonna go with the second one which is detailed and then here the elevation is gonna be dependent whether it's gonna be touch the ground or no which is i go with 10 and the thickness is three meter uh, the thickness three milli and then here if you want to check or work again on it over here the line i make it black and the surface right which is override surface it's gonna be like carton you can select any color you want it or upload another texture so i'm gonna click ok and then i'm gonna go with here at the point at this part and then here we have five different kind of things which is one is not visible but we're gonna now work with this two, which is arc by three point and arc by center point. I'm gonna click arc by three point and I will show you how it works. So here we're gonna click randomly any place, click OK. And then at this point, point I'm gonna click here OK. And then it's gonna get, show me the circle up or down. So I'm gonna go with down part, I'll click OK point. And then here again, and then OK show me close or open so which means that clicking three times this is one and this is two and again three we do like this it show you like a different wavy shape in a good way which is uh the line is going to help us to draw inside it which is more like clean and um, in detailed way so i'm going to click like this okay and again one more okay so I'm gonna go with arc by center point which is the different is here we have up part which is 20 and down part is 20 so we don't want to work outside the line so we're gonna go here with around 20 and then I will go circle at this part okay and then again 20 and then okay again 20 I'm gonna go with up part the same thing or you can mix it again like not to make it more in the same shape like this okay again one more and then mix it again with the center point which is I go with 20 So we can do also a mirror over here. So we're gonna we reach out the center. So I'm gonna go OK until this part and then OK. And right click OK. And then here we have the an extraction length, which is the length of uh, the shear tool. I'm gonna go with 2900. I'm gonna click OK. And then I will click this one again, uh, Shift plus Control plus M, which is mirror. And then I will click on mirror over here okay so let's go to 3d and see how it's look like this is how it's look like 
you see it is good not bad now we have to like for example if you want to do another one in front copy uh, control plus uh, D plus shift and then we're gonna bring it over here and then what we're gonna do is uh, to make the work more easier for us uh, which is here we're gonna close over here like to the point click on this dimension and then we are gonna close it over here like that okay one more and then here also one more and then i will make it a little bit closer okay and then i will mirror it i'll click on this control plus shift plus m i'll go at the center of this i'm gonna go with mirror and then i will change the color to make it more different I'll go with around like beige, something like that, golden beige, okay? And then I will make it a more closer to this curtain, like this, a little bit. Yeah, let's check how it looks like. If there is any problem, you can work with it, like moving it a little bit. Okay, you can just move this one a little bit over here okay over here also fix it let's see so look how it's look like in a simple way and more than design which is going to be not visible at the top uh covered with the ceiling inside and this is how it look like in uh, three steps the first we measured the dimension of the window and then we just draw it overhead document and then after we draw we just design uh, during the shield tool so if you have any questions you can just comment below and please don't forget to subscribe like and share and thank you for watching